The Diddy Sapphire deposit goes down in history as one of the most important mines to produce the most important sapphire colors and ruby colors in the world. In the gemstone hunter world, it's known as the imposter mine because it is the only mine in the world that could mimic the finest quality Burmese rubies as well as the finest quality cashmere sapphires. It produced colors that are not indicative to its local area. It is just an amazing freak of nature that mother nature gave all the fine colors in this one particular location the mine was very short-lived only stayed open for about nine months because what happened is some illegal loggers in the national reserve were pulling down trees and in the roots they found these two stones they didn't know anything about the stones, so they went to tana the capital and they sold it to a sri lankan guy who was a friend of mine for twenty thousand dollars he then basically took those stones sold them in Sri Lanka for 600000 and then the guy in Sri Lanka, who's also my friend, ended up selling them at Sotheby's for $2 million because the sapphire looked like top gem cashmere and the ruby looked like amazing quality Burma. Now, this particular material, what happened is when that immediately happened and $20,000 were handed to these loggers, of course, the word spread and all of a sudden you had like the gold rush. You had 10,000 people heading towards a national reserve to start looking and mining in this particular area which is not you're not allowed to mine in this particular area anyway they got away with it for about seven eight nine months until the military came in and just removed everybody out of this particular area i was one of the first people in during the the first discoveries and i did get some important stones out of there a lot for you know for research purposes to understand the locale that you know the different types of material that comes from there and I wanted to find you know also the sapphires that look like cashmere or the rubies that look like Burma but this is the only star I was able to recover out of the Diddy sapphire mines and if you look at it the star is the pinnacle of top six ray star this star is so vivid and so intense it is fully certified Madagascar Diddy material with a perfect star unheated it's the only one I got extremely rare it mimics the most important Burmese rubies it has a perfect six ray star if you like that asterism and you like that effect there is no top in this this is one of the best you'll ever see the stone weighs in at 3.11 carats you've got Oh, a mountain of D flawless here, almost two carats of D flawless. Because cat knows this is going to auction, baby. This is a rare stone. Not many people, a lot, a lot of people collect Diddy, but nobody has Diddy that's a star like this. Important stone, collectible, rare, hits all the points for the collector who just wants what nobody can replace. The mine closed in 2012 and will never be opened again.